Hey guys, JJ Jester here again. Um, I was just going to cover this really quick since uh, it's all uncovered now. <clears throat> but uh, basically, all this is is my item frame combination lock just much, much shorter. Just because the distance that it can travel is only three. Because the cauldron only has the three levels. Um, let me fill this up. Uh, and that. Fill that one, that one, that one. Alright, and now the door is shut. Okay, we got two. Two and one and doors back open but that's all it is this is just the same setup just shorter the bottom ones go down and back to a torch and that one can't really see it it's covered up but <clears throat> the top ones well everything goes back to a torch just the top ones are different to save a little space don't have to worry about things connecting together when you don't want them to. I'll go into a lit torch. If you got the wrong password in. Torch goes off because all the redstone at the back is lit up. But that's that. This one here is the generic vending machine that everybody and their brother has a design for. They're usually all the same design. But uh, I went ahead and made this one because I've made it before and it's actually very simple to do. Oh, let's put in that. And it's set to there. Give it a minute to come down. Ah. Should be there by now. Am I out? No, I got two stack. Stack and a half of that. Okay. Why is that not working? It was just working a minute ago. There it goes. And that's that. Okay, let's... I went ahead and put my hopper here because I think everybody usually has their hopper like right there or right out here. Um, usually in that area. I went ahead and moved the whole payment system. Redid it so that it was smaller. On this one, I think it's. I basically just moved it. I'm, I did one today while I was sitting and waiting to see if I was going to be a juror or not. I was bored because I was sitting there for seven hours. So I did one on my other device, which is a different design. This one's kind of the same one everybody else has. <clears throat> but. The inner workings of this thing is simple because you got all the way out to eight but what makes this work is whatever it's set on what the heck happened there whatever one it's set on like this one's set on eight it'll light up the bottom one won't light up the next block up because that's technically nine Okay, so technically this one is not lit up, so it's not powered. It will get its power when you put in your payment system. When you trigger whatever you're using for your payment system. Because somewhere around here, there is power going into this block, which turns... When your payment system goes through, it turns this torch off, which in turn 
And I gotta go over here. Which powers this, or unpowers this. Because when your torch goes off, this goes off, which allows it to spit whatever, you know, to put whatever it needs, whichever one of these you have selected, it'll put it into the hopper, bring, the, bring it down, and it'll stay. I put a uh, dispenser here, so whatever you have coming through the hopper, it will come down, it'll stay there until you hit the button. That is that. That one's very simple. Um, I'm going to probably do a tutorial on this one. I'm just not going to do it today because I'm extremely tired. So guys, just stay tuned. I will do this one tomorrow. Um, and it will be a, just a vending machine that you can basically set up the way you want it. Um, I'm just going to do the blank. <clears throat> any machine and then you can just set it up however you want but anyways uh, I will catch you guys later have fun <laughs>